What is your favorite Aretha Franklin song to perform? Ain't No Way, without a question. That is just one of my favorite songs to perform. I feel like it shows her full range of emotion and I love singing because it's a task for me and it challenges me and it just feels good to sing. Ain't no way for me to love you if you won't let me. It ain't no way. And so it goes. <laughs> Can you tell us one thing you learned from writer-director Casey Lemons? One thing, I learned so many, uh, but the one thing I learned from her is that the best way to get what you need from people is to extend kindness. She was extremely kind and patient with me, with everyone on set, and I think she got the result that she wanted. So yeah. How would you like to see Harriet Tubman honoured in 2020? By being put on the $20 bill because she needs to be put on the $20 bill because she deserves it, that's how. Hmm. <laughs> if you become the youngest EGOT winner, uh, which former EGOT winner would you like to celebrate with? Ooh. Probably Whoopi Goldberg because she's kind of awesome and I've definitely somewhat followed in her footsteps anyway, so I definitely think that she would be the one person that I would celebrate with if that happens. Yeah. <laughs>What's one thing people can do to help bring about equality right now? Um, if you see something, say something, don't ignore it. If you feel like at the workplace someone might be being treated a little bit different than you are, talk about it. Ask someone. Tell someone. Ask how other people are dealing with things, how, what people's experiences are. The only way to learn about something and to help fix something is if you actually have a conversation with people who are having experiences that are different to yours. So, yeah, ask questions. Talk about it, um, ask what people need from you, and I think that'll probably help you. Yeah. Where do you like to go to write music? I kind of write music all over the place, really. Sometimes it might be on a plane, sometimes it might be in my front room, sometimes it might be in my bedroom. I sometimes go to the studio with, with producers and just sit and just listen to music and get writing. Sometimes it might be in the shower. It depends where the inspiration hits me first. What is the song that made you want to become a professional singer? Silent Night. <laughs> this is the first song I, I sang by myself. I was five years old and I just liked how it felt. I liked the fact that people were happy to hear me sing. And so I knew that I should sing. So I guess that's the first song. Yeah. Huh. And I've been fishing. With the Hollywood Reporter. <laughs> <laughs>